Yes, yeah, that's, that's good advice. Thanks. What What about for someone who wanted to, to get into Hollywood now? <laughs> yeah. Um, look, I I I used to be very bitter. Yeah. And <laughs> my girlfriend knows that. My very good friends know that. My family knows that. So I'm not bitter. I because I don't want to ruin an industry. If yeah. you want to make movies, you want to be an actor, go do it with your heart. Yeah. Right. And and my best advice to you, and whether you're a creator, executive, whatever you want to be a DP, I wanted to be a DP. I want to be a cinematographer. That's what I wanted to do in the beginning. I was all visual. I wanted to visually do it. But um, my advice to you is just make the product. Don't pitch it. No one will talk to you. The agents are a bunch of jerks. Just make it. Make your content. Do it. Don't talk about it. That's the mistake I made. I should have shot feature films. I used to shoot shorts and bits and pieces and funny, weird spec spots. And I'd write screenplays and try to pitch and want to read my script. Just, just do it. Find a rich family member. <laughs> go shoot your movie. Call Netflix and show it to them as a finished film. Okay? That's my best advice to you. Wow. That's awesome, man. You try to dance in that world. You try to like, I'm a, look, look, I'm not super talented, okay? I wasn't the best actor. I'm not the best writer. I'm not Hemingway. I'm not Kerouac. I'm not, okay? If you have supreme talent, you're going to make it. But if you're someone like me, like kind of an average Joe, do the advice I just gave you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, you seem like a cool guy, man. Like I am a cool guy to hang out with and yeah. talk to, man, for sure. You know, I, I am. Yeah, you seem like someone I'd, I'd get along with, you know, and just... But that's why I'm here, it's, man. It's great talking to you. I, I, I don't know how much time you got left, but... Um, yeah, you can do a couple more minutes. I mean, I think if it's not too, too long, because yeah, I know my sure. friend did it, you know, it's like, you know, the, the size of a Marvel movie. Like, yeah. you just got to be careful. But, hey, man, look, I'm, a, I'm willing to come on any time with you, man. You want to yeah. do John Benet Ramsey. You want to do any true crime? You want to do Natalie Wood, Aaron Hernandez? You yeah. want to talk about any of these stories, dude? My door's open to you anytime. Thanks, man. I I really did want to ask you about the Zodiac Killer. Oh yeah, yeah. I put I did something in. Did you see that in Australia? No, no, I haven't. But yeah, that's so what I wanted I'll to... plug. I'll plug the guy's show, Ashes to Ashes. Okay. Reach out to him. I don't want to say his name. People get mad when I say their names. Just go to YouTube and search Ashes to Ashes, Zodiac, Chris Todd. Okay. That's it. You'll see it. He's a good guy. Yeah. Kind of met him like I'm meeting you. Kind of same, uh -huh. you know, cool guy, nice guy, yeah. like, you know. And, um, yeah, so I helped solve Zodiac. I didn't solve it because I stumbled upon these witnesses, these children who were sexually abused by the Zodiac himself. Wow. And the Zodiac is Arthur Lee Allen. And I'm going to tell you straight up. How can they never, they never caught him? Like... Well, Thomas, let's ask ourselves, why did they never catch Charlie Ehrlich and OJ Simpson? Yeah. Why? Ego, negligence, cover up, stupidity. Yeah. And I don't like to say the word stupid fat or ugly. I tell my kids never to say those words. So, but the Zodiac case, are we okay to give a minute to this? I'd love to give a minute to, to the victims for Zodiac. hundred percent. Yeah. Okay, man. So there are over, there are nine other murders that the Zodiac committed. I could start naming them Domingos Edwards um, in Santa Barbara County. Hood Garcia, Santa Barbara County, couples murdered, okay? The Swindle couple in San Diego, the two Laotian or Thai immigrants in Sacramento in 1986, Koi and Choi, those are their first names. There's many people that got murdered that were never figured out that it was Zodiac. Arthur Lee Allen, you can rot in hell. Now, the San Francisco PD, knew it was him and covered it up. Now, if we wanna give them an out and say, well, they didn't cover it up because they didn't have enough evidence. Here we go again. 
What is evidence? Okay. They knew it was him. The guy ID'd him in 91, which took a long year, uh, many years later, Mike Majot, he ID'd him. That's the guy that shot me. But it took a long time. This family, these kids, I won't say their, their name. They're on YouTube. Go to YouTube. Okay. Go to YouTube and type in, we called him Mr. Allen. Wow. And watch these kids' stories. They're in their 60s now. Go listen to them. Because look, I'll give them the thunder, man. They want to yeah. come forward. Go contact them. Their yeah. email is there. Yeah. It's right there in their about section. They were abused by sexually by the Zodiac. Arthur Leone drugged them. And he took them on two murder runs. They were there. Oh, and one of them, one of them, in 1963, Domingo Edwards, they were there at the crime scene. They saw him covered in blood. Wow. They were nine years old, seven years old. They were young. They didn't talk. Their mom knew. Maybe she died, so I'm not going to try to slander her. Did the mom know? I think she did. They called her a monster. She was friends with Arthur Leone. He was a teacher at Santa Rosa Elementary School. What's wow. up? What's up? He said he was going to shoot the tires out of the, the bus and then plug all the little kitties when they came bouncing off. What's up? Yeah. And then he got caught for child molestation in the 70s, early 70s, 74, somewhere in there. And all the letters stop. And what happens when he gets back out? They get their first letter again. Watch the movie Zodiac by David Fincher. Yeah. It's a very important movie because Fincher... And those actors, Jill and Hall, Down, uh, yeah, and and Mark Ruffalo had the courage. There's some real people in Hollywood. There are. There's yeah. some brilliant people. Yeah, watch that movie. They had the courage to solve the murder. It was Arthur Lee Allen. Yeah, they show you. They tell you that movie is so rich and so genius. Fincher and the actors and the writers, whoever I think Fincher wrote it. It's based on the book by Robert Gray Smith. Okay, yeah. the reporter who said, I just want to know. I just want to know. I have to look him in the eyes. And guess what? I met someone that knew Robert Graysmith and was there when he went to the hardware store and looked Arthur Lee Allen in the eyes. Wow. Yeah, it's in the movie. Now, oh, yeah. chills, man. Now I'm giving, I'm giving Hollywood a bump here. Fincher and those actors do a brilliant job. That script that movie is so detailed so rich you cannot grasp it watching it once it's impossible it's impossible so if you watch it a few times right and you research in between when you watch it you'll see it but if you watch it just once it comes at you so fast like aaron sorkin you know aaron sorkin he wrote facebook and you yeah. know molly's game and he's like a genius savant like in his language, he just shoots these things. I don't know how the actors even do it. Like he's, <laughs> he has so many words. No, he has, he's one of the best screen. I think he's the best screenwriter of all time, to be honest. Yeah. But um, so Fincher's movies like that, you can't grasp it. The letters and the ciphers, well, the ciphers, and you're like, wait, 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 rewind. What, what, what did you say about the ciphers? Like, so check that out. But you know, for those victims, and obviously the, the, the regular victims, Sherry Jo Bates, um, Majot, I forget some of the names sometimes, you know, uh, Lake Berryessa, um, uh, Vallejo, right? Um, Farron, there's, I don't have all the notes in front of me, my head's in the OJ thing. Yeah. But, um, you know, obviously those five victims that were attributed, there's nine more. Yeah. That's a lot, man, that's yeah. a lot. That's 14 total victims. Nine and five is 14. Okay. Yeah. And so, and look, they've done good work. Go to zodiackillers.com. Go to zodiackillerfacts.com. There's two guys. I won't say their names. They've done more research on these things. I've spoken to both of them. One guy told me to fuck off. The other guy was receptive. No, I swear to God, dude. This is like, it's like, I'm like, don't you want the truth? Yeah. Tell the truth. You knew it was Arthur Lee Allen. No, you know, I don't think it. I think it's um, this guy, the uh, cold breaker said, uh, cold case breaker. They